At this assembly plant not far from Charleston, South Carolina, workers are putting together mine-resistant, ambush-protected vehicles called MRAPs. They're designed to keep U.S. troops safe in Iraq and Afghanistan. The vehicles, which cost about $450,000 each, are made of specially made steel and thick planed glass. They also have a V-shaped hull that's designed to counter the signature weapon of the war in Iraq, the IED. Well, it, it's important because uh, the majority of combat deaths in Iraq are caused by roadside bombs. Uh, and the Defense Department needed to come up with something that would protect soldiers, keep them from getting killed and maimed. This particular model is called the Cougar, and this plant is putting out about 300 of them each month. This is a game of, of, of continually trying to increase the survivability uh, within the vehicle, knowing that your enemy is, is not giving up. An even larger MRAP is also being built called the Buffalo. The vehicles have been attacked more than 3,000 times since they were first introduced overseas, but officials say only three Americans have died in those attacks. The reaction we hear is, is, is very, very positive. They like them. I mean, they, anything that can take you into harm's way and bring you back out unhurt is a good thing. The Cougar sits about three feet off the ground, it seats six people, and can travel at speeds up to 65 miles per hour. It's also easy to repair. Officials say when a bomb damages its exterior, it can be fixed in as little as three days. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.